first road trip with a baby. Not really, but she's in the tummy. And we got the dogs. I don't know, I doubt you can see them. It's too dark, but here we go. Florida, day one. Woohoo! <laughs> We have an active passenger here looking out the window, watching the road and the cars. And then we got a sleepy little log down there. So this morning I wake we wake up at like 5 20, oh, no. 5 30 to get ready to go because we had to pack up all our stuff. We wanted to be on the road by six. And so last night when I got in bed, it was really late and it was dark in there because Christina went to bed like two or three hours before me because that's just what she did um, <laughs> tired yeah so I go to sleep and I had a braid in my hair which you probably saw in yesterday's video and so I took the braid out and I threw my ponytail on the ground so when I woke up this morning at 5 20 I was like okay I'm like groggy I need first thing I always do is brush my teeth and wash my face so I was getting I was looking for my ponytail to put my hair up to go do that and so I see like this brown circle on the ground. So I go to pick it up because I'm like, oh good, my ponytail. You guys, when I picked this up, it was a turd. A wet, squishy poopsicle. I picked up a piece of poop this morning. And I was it was disgusting. Because I need them to understand the things that happen. This is the vlog miss. They need to know what happens in our day. This I'll always listen, happens to me. I just want y'all to know, I was in the other, ba the other bathroom brushing my teeth, getting ready, and I hear a scream, and I thought that Ollie had like jumped on her or something while she was still in the bed, or Parker did. But then I looked down beside me, because they're normally always outside the bathroom door with me, and I was like, they're both right there, and she screamed again a few minutes later, and I hear Ollie like, or see Ollie like turn his head, like, what's going on in there? And then finally I'm like, so you're okay? And then I hear what happened, and I was like, I like wanted to go on a turtle shell and like run away because I thought that it was gonna be a really bad morning. I was just like so shocked because it was so early. I was literally dead asleep and I picked up a, a turd. I think they get it, so this story's uncomfortable. So, no, it's a good story. Because I was busy doing chores. Y'all saw I did dishes, laundry, edited the video. I wasn't thinking about the dogs. I was like, they're sleeping. No, she wasn't sleeping. She was pooping on the floor. It was disgusting. Anyways, end of story. This turned into way long of a story. I'm going to edit all this out. Okay, bye. Playing questions, and the question was, what is your favorite date that we've had? Well, it wasn't really a date. It was just something that we did that was like my favorite thing, which was my surprise birthday party two years ago, mm. or a year ago, I guess. We went to Ocean City, and you had the car packed, and all my clothes packed, and you said, just get in the car. So I didn't have to plan anything. I didn't have to drive. I didn't have to do anything. She and didn't I've even know we were leaving. I literally packed her clothes and she got home and I was like, okay, let's go. She even packed my bracelets and all kinds of stuff that I would want. Like she, and she got me a fishing pole because I got to go fishing. That's one of my favorite things to do. And yeah, it was amazing. 100% best trip gift ever done. Because I've never not drove or participated <laughs> in planning or getting anything together. And two of our friends were sitting in the car when I got in it. 100% best gift you could ever give someone. Surprise trip, everything packed. They have no planning, no stress, no driving. Just have fun. Yeah, it's the best thing ever. Ollie? What are you looking at? Poor puppies. Ollie? Hello, we're up here. What are you looking at back there? Watching the cars. Hi. All Say right. hello to the people. Say hello road for six plus hours now. North Carolina. Yeah. Make it. It's 12.55 and we've gone about six, seven hours so far. Many hours left to go. <sighs> Smile. Cheese. Oh. <laughs> Ignore the, all the bugs on the car, but here are antlers and our noses in action. Got our reindeer car. Yep. Where are we? We're in the middle of Georgia, almost to Florida. Heading in for another pit stop before we switch off. Forgot my water bottle. Okay. Good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, the 8th, 19th, 19th. Um, we are actually at our friend's house that we stopped at last night in Orlando. or right outside Orlando. So I wanted to show you guys a quick tour of where we stayed last night. Because we're packing up and we're getting ready to leave. 
we will be stopping back on the way back from our trip to stay here again to visit with our friend it's really christina's friend but she's my friend now too but i will show you guys a quick tour of everything okay so when you first walk in the front door you see our schmoofy he's crying because he wants to go outside and then you can either go up the stairs or right here is the bedroom that she's using for storage right now and then she has her it's like considered a master but also this is like a guest bathroom that connects to that bedroom right here so that's a nice little shower and me look at the little baby bump okay then you come back out oh my camera's gonna die come back out and this is a storage room again and then over here on the right is a nice little kitchen with some marble counters i'm stealing all our food oh i'm standing under the lamp the kitchen's really nice and open and it's open layout so you come right over into the huge living room which she has blankets covering the rug for because her cat gets sick during the day but and they got a little tv stand and whatnot and then you can come straight back and she has her own personal little pool. These are like a set of like townhomes. She has her own personal little pool. Christina let Winnie fall into that corner <laughs> this morning. She comes up and she's like, her fall? What are you, are you joking? She fell <laughs> and I saved her. I let her fall. <laughs> You're a terrible narrator. Don't let her back out. But anyways, yeah, Winnie fell in the pool this morning and Christina had to get her out. Um, so that's the downstairs. Go up all these stairs. This is why I want a ranch. And you got a nice linen closet. You have laundry. And then this is the room we stayed in last night. It has its own bathroom. Very cute, very nice, very updated. And then you come into the bedroom, which this is like considered, really they all have their own bathroom, so it's like they're all masters. But anyways, just a little bed. And then it has a little seating area, super cute, and then a closet. And then if you come back this way, if you go straight from the stairway, oh, well, hello. Hello. You go into her bedroom with her cute little cat. And you have her bed, her dresser. I'm giving a tour. I just let him, this, this kitty's been through a lot. This cat's been through more moves than anyone. Sweet cat. Went. Tell them people hello. He's really good with dogs too. So then over here you can come into her bathroom, which is really nice. It has a really big shower that has tile up to the ceiling. It's like double the size of ours. And the shower head's really nice. And then double vanity, which she gets all to herself. Lucky duck. We don't even have a double. And then over here is her closet. Do 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 very nice big walk-in and then you can walk out onto a huge back deck like if you see across they have decks that's what hers is too i'm not gonna go out there it's real warm it's a really cute little town home that she got it's her first house she's owned so it's exciting for her she just moved from texas to florida so we got real lucky being able to stay with her didn't have to pay for a hotel so <sighs> christina's being our pack mule right now i'm gonna go help her There's so many stairs all at one time. Okay, we're gonna throw. because uh, Linda is super hungry and she's still trying to eat healthy. So we're running in to get a bagel. Right, Linda? Look at that belly. Boop. She doesn't ever listen to me, guys. I talk so much she just tunes it out. I don't blame her. We got the dogs a doggy bagel. We're going to go feed them while we wait. It's hard as a rock. I thought you were going to break that, Linda. I can't break it. Way to break it. Give me that. <laughs> All right. I got you a bagel. Ooh. Oh, look at it. Uh, don't look like you want it. Oh, all right. Hang on. 
I gotta take the bagel back in. The journey goes back in. I have to cut it. It's hard as a rock. I wouldn't want to eat this if I was a dog. Journey of the bagel continues. All right. Can anyone see this? How hard this thing is? <laughs> just right. Give it to Ollie to chew and then I'll drop Anybody it. hear how hard this is? I don't think I'm feeding that to, whoops. I don't think I'm feeding that to the dogs. <laughs> they can chew on it later. Ollie's really upset. He was like, just go give it to him. Blueberry's my fave. What'd you say, Linder? You can get $20, 13 bagels, four pastries, and two things of cream cheese. That would last for the whole week. That's a lot of carbs. What you got there? I got my bagel sandwich. I'm what? so hungry. What else is in there? Oh, so it's an Asiago bagel with veggie cream cheese and egg and cheddar. It's gonna be so good and relatively healthy. It's a lot of... Asiago bagel's not so great, but it's delicious, so. And we're in Florida, which we were there last night with my friend Laura, but we're very, very excited to be here. We're like 10 minutes away from the place, so super excited. Get in my belly. Right, this is our studio apartment tour for our Airbnb. It's literally all one room. So we have a little end table, a couch that's gonna be our bed. It's a pullout bed. And then we have a stool, dog's water, then we have this TV stand, which is basically our dresser. We unpacked all our stuff into it. Extra chair, which is extra storage, which if you keep that gift there, all he's gonna get into it. That's why I put it up. Um, and then if you come over here, we have our little dinette, which is also a storage house for Winnie. And then in here is like a little closet. It's got some hangers and water heater and a cooler if we want to take that to the beach with a bunch of beer for Christina and water for me. Say. Got our little kitchenette and it's got a sink and a couple cupboards and we brought all our protein and aminos and everything. Tiny little stove, it's so small. So cute. Little baby fridge, we're storing all the dog's food on top here. We really had to get creative, which I guess these are probably empty. Oh, well, maybe I'll put it up there. <laughs> and then little baby fridge. And then the last thing is the only other room is this bathroom. So we hung some more clothes up we didn't have a lot of storage. Tiny baby shower. <laughs> Literally smaller than nice. our house. Oh, it's long though. We have more room than Perfect I thought. shower to wash the dogs. Yep. <clears throat> and then a little baby window, towels, mirror, and that. Can't beat the price for like seven days here. That's yeah. That's for sure. Yep, it's literally beachfront. We're like 100 yards from the beach, but. This is it. You can just, just see it all in one circle. She has no choice but to snuggle with me on that thing. Oh, I know. I don't know how we're going to fit my pregnancy pillow. You need to be next to the air unit so you're not hot. Yeah. Ready! <laughs> hey guys, it's much later now. We did a lot. We went to the beach, took the dogs to the beach. We went shopping. I got a bunch of dresses in here. I can show you guys later. And now we're about to go, my family's here, so we're about to meet them for dinner. And yeah, ready? Hello? Yeah. We're heading into the restaurant right now. I'm not gonna vlog, because I don't want necessarily my family on the internet right now. I have to talk to my mom about it. But we're gonna go get some good good, and she's gonna get some drinks. Gotta oh, wake her up a little. I'm sleepy. Yeah, but all right, we'll see you guys in a little bit. Peace out, Girl Scouts. It's cold and Christina just tried to bite my lip off. Can you guys see that? You see that? She tried to bite my lip off. Um, We were going in for a kiss. I tried to tooth tap her and then her tooth went through my lip a little bit. I don't know why I always talk to that. I need to just put that down so I don't look at I it. I know. You um, do, but you want to look at yourself. because you're. I can't help it. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we just finished up. We ate dinner with my family and hung out at their place for a little bit until bedtime. But now we got to go check on the dogs. And I'm going to show you guys really quick the outfits that I got. And then I'm going to edit and post this vlog because I have to combine the two. And I don't want to be up all night. So, you know what I'm going to do, peeps? I'm going to go sleep. Yes. It's a very small apartment though, or a studio, which y'all already saw, so if I'm awake, she's awake, basically. Nope. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys everything when we get back in like a few minutes. 
Bye. All right, Christina's gonna be my model while I do a voiceover. So the first thing that we have here is a very cute flowy dress. It looks really cute on my bump. It's perfect for the beach and to go out. <laughs> we love it. How much was that? $12.99. Next up, we have this navy romper, which is really cute. It's just spaghetti straps. And it has a tie that's gonna go above my belly, I think we decided. They're capris, so it's just a really nice flowy outfit to wear. Yeah, it's really cute which I'll show you guys my outfit of the day every day. Get Ollie. <laughs> Next up, we have this cute little stretchy thing, which is really gonna fit me probably all the way until I give birth. Ooh. Very stretchy. It's just gray and white stripes with some buttons, which I don't even know, do the buttons actually work? No. Okay, so it's just for decoration, but it's very stretchy, very comfy. It'll be good. $12.99. Romper was $9.99. This is all from TJ Maxx, by the way. And then this one is a really thick t-shirt dress. It's an ombre with pink and white. And it's going to be really good to help block out some of the wind on the beach. It's got some cuffed sleeves. It's just really cute for a little cover-up. What did Winnie find now? Did you find another bone to eat? Yep. Next, we I had to get some new tops because I've grown a lot. So we got this one from Walmart, actually. Very conservative. It covers up a lot, so I liked it for a good family trip. That's then seven dollars. This we found at Goodwill. And not yeah. just another top option. It's like a gingham navy and white. Very cute. Very it's like full coverage, no cleavage on that. And then last but not least we ordered our family shirts. My mom got them for us. Super cute. Santa Claus. Okay, turn it around. Eat Beach Sleep Repeat Family Vacation 2019. So all of us have it. There's like, I don't even know how many of us there are, like 12 probably. Mm -hmm. We're all gonna be wearing them together. So I'm really excited. And then this is like a comfy, like lounging sleep bra that we got. And it's also like a see-through, or a, what is it called? When it's like the no-show material. It's like the no-show material. I don't know. But she had one of these that was like a pinkish color that she loved and she lost it, so. It looks like a granny bra. And it's so soft, I love it. <laughs> I don't wear it, but I like it. It's very comfy, it's comfy yeah. to wear to bed and whatnot. But that's all we got, and then I got, oh, we should have done my cardigan hanging up. The last thing that I got, because it's been cooler here, I got this tan cardigan, because it matches literally every dress that we got. And it's really cute, and even though there's holes in it, it's, re it's pretty warm for when we're like out walking the dogs and on the beach and whatnot, so. So cutesy, I'd even wear it. <laughs> I wore it tonight even it's with my, I wore it with my shorts and my tank top. But yeah, so that's everything we got. And I'm gonna get to editing this video, you guys. So I hopefully you enjoyed our little tour and our haul and we'll have some beach action for you all tomorrow. So thank you yep. for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.